Hey everyone, and welcome back to another great eShop Deals video. Now again this week, we've got another amazing list with over 30 awesome games on sale to recommend. Always as a quick reminder, I let you know however that I don't go over the games that were mentioned in last week's eShop Deals video. So if you always want to make sure that you're not missing out on any of the great games that are on sale, it's always a good idea to check out that video that'll be linked up above. Also, as usual, about halfway through the video, we'll be announcing this week's winner of the $5 eShop gift card. If you're wondering how you can participate in that weekly giveaway, all you need to do is check out the midweek video of the eShop deals under $5. You drop a comment in that video, you're automatically entered in the giveaway. Now, last little thing before we get started, don't forget that if you like the content to please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Now the first game on our list, we're going to start right away with one of the big ones, Axiom Verge 2 is already 10% off on sale. Of course, this is a launch special, setting the game at $17.99. Now this game is a Metroidvania that released just this week, and I know a lot of people were waiting for the release of this game. It's still a little early because I haven't played my way all through the game, but I did stream the first hour and a half approximately of the game, and it is looking very, very solid. So if you were waiting for this release, at least we have a slight discount already at 10% off. The only thing I would say, however, is the first one is also on sale this week at 10% off. I would stay away from that one unless you're really burning to play it, because it's already been sub $10 at more than 60% off. Now next, we have Among Us at 20% off for $4. Now just in case you didn't know, this is a multiplayer only game. You can play in local co-op or you can play online. And let me tell you that if you have a bunch of friends that you want to get together and have some laughs, currently there's pretty much no better option than Among Us on your Nintendo Switch. Now next on the list, we have The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim at 50% off for $29.99. Now, I don't actually think this game needs much of an introduction, but if you're unaware, it's an open world action RPG, and it is pretty much one of the biggest games available on the Switch. If you want a game that you can drop hundreds of hours of gameplay into at only $30, even though it's one of the more expensive games on today's list, this overall is a game that is an amazing experience. Now next is a game that I have to mention every time it's on sale, Just Dance 2021, 60% off for $19.99. This is another one of those party games that it's great to have around because when people come over, you just drop a Joy-Con in their hand and you go crazy having some tons of laughs. On top of it, my girls love this game, they play it on a regular basis, and at $20, it's a decent investment. Next is a game that I'm taking from my under $5 list of this week, This War of Mine, that is 90% off for only $3.99. Now, I'm talking about this game here because I want to make sure everyone knows about this deal, because this game is phenomenal. It is a survival slash exploration game where you're living through a war-torn city, but rather than being an armed to the teeth soldier, you're just a normal human trying to get by and trying to keep your close ones alive. Now next on the list we have Crisis Remastered that is still 50% off for $14.99. Now if you're into action FPS games, Crisis is an excellent entry. Only thing I would say for this week, reserve which game you're going to buy till you make it to the end of the list because we have quite a few FPS games on sale this week and you wouldn't want to drop your cash on this one and then realize there was a better deal later on. Next, we have Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate at 60% off for $15.99. Now, if you want another game that you can sink a tons of hours into, Monster Hunter is always a good franchise for that. I just want to give a fair warning. If you've played the latest Monster Hunter game, this one is an earlier entry and the combat is going to feel a little clunkier than the latest entry. So be aware of that before picking it up. But at $16, nonetheless, it is definitely worth it once again. Next, I want to give one last shout out to Ease 8 that is still on sale for about a day at 66% off for $19.99. Now this is a Japanese styled action RPG and it comes from a very long running franchise and on top of it, this is a great entry. Now if you were looking at jumping into the ninth one, I would say buy this one at $20. Hopefully by the time you finish it, we might start getting sales on the ninth one. 
Now, next, we're going to tackle a franchise that is on sale this week. We have Doom Eternal and Doom the Remake that are both 50% off at $29.99. Now, these are pretty much, I would say, the best action FPS games we have with a single player campaign. And Doom Eternal should have been last year's game of the year. But we're not going to have that discussion in this video. I do want to also let you know, however, that on top of the first two games that are on sale, there is also the DLC for Doom Eternal that is on sale separately, and you can get a complete bundle with Doom Eternal and all the DLC at only $53.98. It is a bigger purchase, but you're getting one of the best games ever. So while we're on the subject of franchises that are on sale, let's get another one out of the way right away. The Wolfenstein has two games also on sale. Wolfenstein 2, which I would say is the better entry at 70% off for $17.99. Another classic FPS series, not as good as Doom, but nonetheless has a pretty serious single player campaign. You also have Wolfenstein Youngbloods that is a lot cheaper at $5.99. The only thing is this is a seriously weaker game in my opinion. It is nonetheless worth it because of that $6 price point, but if you're going to pick only up one of the two, I would say go for Wolfenstein 2. Now next on the list we have a great bundle that is back on sale, the Assassin's Creed Rebel Collection at 50% off for $19.99. I say it each and every time, at $20 you're getting two full Assassin's Creed games. And on top of it, these are two of my favorite entries with Black Flag probably being my favorite of all. And at $20, if you're looking for some 3D action adventure, I think that this is one of the best pickups you can make. Now next we have Jurassic World Evolution back to 50% off for $29.99. Now if you are unaware what this game is, it's basically a park builder set in the universe of Jurassic World or Jurassic Park depending on which of the franchises we're talking about. But overall, it is just a really solid park builder. If you are into this type of games, this is one of the best ones we currently have on the Switch. And on top of it, the controls work fantastically on the Switch. It is an excellent port. Now next we have another series that is on sale. We have Saints Row 3 and Saints Row 4 that are on sale, both at 65% off for $13.99. Look, if you like open world, over the top action, Saints Row is a definite series to check out. The fourth one I would say is even the craziest of all, focusing on an alien invasion, throwing in superpowers. Basically, if you like over the top action, Saints Row is a pickup for you. Now next, we have Dragon's Dogma, Dark Arisen, back to 50% off for $14.99. So this is another medieval fantasy themed action RPG on the Switch. And at $15, it maybe isn't as vast as Skyrim, but it is nonetheless a excellent game to pick up for the price you're paying. If you're looking for this type of game, this is actually value wise probably one of the best options. Next, we get to another series that is yet again on sale, the Metro Redux series with both 2033 and Last Light at 65% off for only $8.74. Once again, FPS themed games, great experiences overall, and if you want to pay very little for your games for this week, this is probably your cheapest option in the great FPS games that are currently on sale. Now next, we have the South Park games that are back on sale with the first one, the Stick of Truth, being 60% off for $11.99 and the second one coming in at $14.99 with the Fractured Butthole. Basically, both these games are like playing through a real episode of South Park and both of them have great gameplay on top of it. The first one being more like a turn-based RPG, the second one being like a grid-based strategy RPG. Overall, if you're a fan of South Park humor, you're going to want to pick these games up. So now it's time to announce this week's winner of the $5 eShop gift card. And this week's winner is going to be Spear Twirling Bacoblin, who said, LMAO, I didn't know Rumbo insta buy. And you know what? I hope you enjoyed because at $2, you're right, Rumbo is a crazy and fun game. So all you need to do to claim your $5 eShop gift card is reach out to me in my pinned comment down below in this video. So now we're back to our list with Darkwood that is 50% off for $7.49. Now this is a top-down survival horror game. And you know what? 
it is an extremely creepy experience. If you are looking for a maximum creep factor, even with the top down view, this is a great game to pick up and at only $7.49, in my opinion, it is a steal. Now next, we have another great entry with Immortals Phoenix Rising that is back to 60% off for $23.99. Now this is an open world action adventure game. Think Breath of the Wild meets the combat mechanics of the old school God of Wars. On top of it, if you already own the base game, the DLC is on sale this week. And if you're looking at the full experience, there's also a pack on sale that has some of the DLC automatically included at around $39.99. Now next, we have an ultra budget entry with Agalos at 80% off for $2.99. Now this is a seriously great 2D action platformer with a Metroidvania-like design. And at only $3, if you're a fan of any of those genres, this is like a must-have game for your collection. Currently, I'm even trying to still hunt down an actual physical cartridge for this one, which is becoming more and more difficult. Now another great game that is back to its lowest price ever is Assassin's Creed 3 at 62% off for $14.99. Now same thing as the previous bundle we looked at, this is just a great full Assassin's Creed game. If you're looking for 3D action adventure, of course I personally would pick up first the Rebel Collection, but if you've already played that and you're looking for something else, Assassin's Creed 3 is a great second option. Now next on the list we have another ultra budget option with Daybleed Pixels at 86% off for only $1.99. Now this is a hardcore difficult 2D action platformer. Think Super Meat Boy with slight combat elements thrown in and you get an idea of what to expect from this game. Now if you're into that genre at $2 once again for this week this is a must have in your collection. Now next, we have another great entry that I think is an underrated game on the Switch with The Last Campfire at 60% off for $5.99. Now this is basically a 3D puzzle platformer. Think of a 3D Zelda, but without the combat. However, the visuals are fantastic in this game. The gameplay is really solid. If you're looking back for a laid back puzzle experience, definitely give this game a shot. And at only $6, it is once again a steal. Now next, I'm going to sneak in another ultra budget option with the Gunman Clive HD collection at 60% off once again for $1.99. Now this is a side-scrolling shooter, think Mega Man, but with beautiful hand-sketched graphics. On top of it, at only $1.99 for both games, this is once again one of the best value options for this week. Now next, we have another amazing collection that is on sale, the Child of Light Valiant Hearts collection at 75% off for $7.49. Now, these two games are amazing games, both in visuals and in gameplay. In Child of Light, you get a platformer with RPG-like combat. In Valiant Hearts, you get a 2D side-scrolling action game. But both of these games have really heart-touching storylines to them and are great pickups on their own, by the way, in case you already own one of the two, they are also both on sale individually at $5. Now, I'm able to give one last shout out before the deal runs out on Penny Punching Princess that is now 75% off for $9.99. Now this is basically a brawler meets an action RPG. And as the title suggests, in this game you can buy everything, including your enemies' allegiances. It is a top-notch funny game only thing, at its full price of $40, I would have definitely stayed away, but now finally at 75% off, this is a steal of a game. Now next, we have Scully at 75% off for $7.49. Now this is a 3D platformer where at some parts of the game you're playing as a ball, other ones you become a humanoid shape. But once again, as the last game, at its full price of $30, there are better options on the eShop. However, when it's on sale at $7.49, it becomes a really great pickup. Next, we have another game that I think is underrated on the Switch, Shinsekai Into the Depths at 25% off for $14.99. Now, this is basically a Metroidvania with a real original premise because it all happens underwater with underwater-like mechanics. But overall, if you are into the Metroidvania genre, 
and you want something a little bit different, this is an excellent game to pick up. And at $14.99, it is definitely worth the investment. I would even say this is a full price pickup. Now, while we're on the subject of full price pickups, we have Evergate that is 33% off for $6.69. Now, a sale on this game is great, but this is another game that even at full price, $10, I would say is an easy pickup. It is a great 2D puzzle platformer. And if you're into this genre and you have not tried Evergate yet, I'm telling you right away, invest your money. $6.69 is definitely worth it. Now, next, we have two shoot 'em ups that are in sale in both Gunbird 1 and Gunbird 2. We're looking at Gunbird 2, but it's the same deal on both. They're 20% off at $6.39. Now, these are some top down shoot 'em ups with some cutie up elements because it has a pretty original cast of characters. Overall, if you're into the cutie up genre or even just the shoot 'em ups, these are really decent pickups, even at their full prices. So, right now, even though it's only a 20% off, I still recommend both these games. And now, to wrap up this week's list, we're going to have one last great budget bundle with the Bleed Complete bundle at 85% off for $4.19. Basically, you're getting two platforming bullet hells for only $4. It is an insane value, and both these games are overall great games. Only thing, they're fairly short, which is why it really feels good to pick them both up at this low price. So that was pretty much it for our list of eShop deals for this week. Now, don't forget to tune in to this week's under $5 eShop deals video. I sneaked in a few deals into this list, but this week there are a ton of great games under $5. Make sure you check in on Wednesday. That video will be out early in the day. Also, I really need to take a couple of seconds to thank the channel supporters. They helped the channel grow in a major way. If you want more information, the link for memberships is down below. And don't forget on the way out to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you aren't already, and hit the notification bell so you know when all my future content comes out. And as usual, I hope I'll see all of you in my next video.